<laughs> Yo, what up this planet now? In this gameplay, I kind of highlight two things. I highlight how sorry Cap is, and I highlight how great Mark Ingram is. Now, Mark Ingram runs better for me than I have than I have had. With I don't, does that make sense? No, it doesn't. He runs better than for. Oh my god, I'm not restarting this. So it is what it is. Uh, let me burp into the mic as well to let you know that I'm not restarting this. Um. Mark Ingram runs better than any other running back I've had on my roster so far. And I don't know why. He's not fast. He's strong, though. He's strong. He has, like, 95 trucking, 94 carry. He has, like, 88, 89 speed. Uh, mediocre acceleration. But, like, at the end of the day, like, what, what, really, bro? Bitches, you crazy? Oh, and, and anyways. So, yeah, he runs better for me than anyone. Like, I've had, in this season alone, I've played... Uh, up to right now, like as in current time, I've played eight games in this season. I think seven games. I'm gonna say seven games. Uh, you know, be sure, <laughs> be sure. So I played seven games in this season. He has over a hundred yards rushing in every last one of those games, and he's and I'm probably handing him the ball 15 times a game. Now, 15 times a game, that's a lot for three four minute quarters, and he hates to go down. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I, it, it is what it is. He hasn't fumbled for me yet, though. Uh, he hasn't fumbled for me yet, and there goes Kaepernick. Yeah, right, like, he does that all the time. Like it, in crucial situations, in clutch situations, he does that, and it just irks the hell out of me. I can't do it. I can't deal with him anymore. If his Kaepernick does it. My Kaepernick does it in his gameplay. You'll see that he overthrows. He underthrows. He just he forces picks. He doesn't. He doesn't force. He go. He, he's overthrowing it. Uh, he doesn't force picks. He just throws picks. <laughs> like. Like, do you understand? Like, it, it has it's situations that require, like, when I got that uh, user with Ke uh, with uh, Keekly, there was no reason why I should have caught that. There was no reason why that ball should have been that far behind. You know what I mean? Like, it, it just doesn't make sense as, I, as Cap go ahead and fumble at a crucial moment, just like last game in real life, fumble on the goal line uh, against the Rams. But, hey, man, he just irks me. But, like I said, Mark Ingram, when, you know, when, when a person dies, you know, somebody takes his place. That's that's how, you know, the earth keeps his balance. And Kaepernick's dying for me. Mark Ingram is being born into a star. As Jadavion, broke legs, clowny, comes up and grabs the ball and let's get out of there. And you already know we in there for six. You know, that man fast as gas, baby. But, uh, yeah, man, like, I, I just can't do it with Cap anymore. And uh, that's just is what it is. Like, I liked him. I liked his mobility. I like, and did I just get mossed? Did that Randy Moss 30 for 30 already come out? Oh, yeah, okay, all right. Um, yeah, but like, I just can't do it with Cap anymore. I, this this commentary is supposed to be meant uh, based around, you know, actual gameplay. But I like as soon as I turn this mic on, like, yo, Kaepernick, it has got to go. And I don't even run options. I don't really scramble all that much as I bomb it deep. See how he bombed it deep on me, and I just reciprocated. I, you know, I gave back, you know. Uh, UNICEF, you know what I mean? <laughs> just give back to the cause, you know what I mean? I had to pay it forward, so he comes out now. Me, on this drive, I was using my linebacker, and I'm like, okay, every time, I'm going to use my linebacker every time, and I'm going to try to pick this dude off, but apparently him and Casper, I didn't show a lot of the other plays, but him and Casper, they they was, you know, light me up downfield. My users was off, and anyways, came back, got the, <laughs> got the pick, and I'm going to make a little move, make a little jig in the hole. And I'm telling you, Mark Ingram, he's a monster as I whoop <laughs> as I pulled a chair on him. But uh, Mark Ingram is a monster. I can't even explain to you how well he's been running for me now. I know I seen D Coop. You know I talked to D Coop last week. You know what I mean? No, anyway, <laughs> I don't know that man. But uh, how was that not a touchdown? Golden Tate is a monster. Golden Tate and Sammy Watkins. If you don't know me, I like uh, receivers that play like running backs, like. If Anquan Bolden was faster, he'd be on the squad. Uh, but I like Golden Tate. I like Sammy Watkins. You know, these big, strong receivers that can get downfield and who has pretty much the same ability as running backs and with the ability to catch the ball because I remember playing with LeGarrette Blunt, the most feared. Yeah, <laughs> that, man, he might as well have not had hands. Like, he might as well just, like, literally, like, just no hands. Like, he just, just had nubs. But anyway. Uh, like I was saying, yo, 
I like receivers that play like running backs as I scramble out the pocket. Now, I don't really scramble all that much because I, I want to get the ball downfield as cap. Come on. That's a touchdown. I stopped. I set your feet. Throw a strike. Give me a touchdown as uh, Jeremy Hill gets up the field. And I don't know. Yo, you know what? I know exactly what I was doing. I wasn't trying to I wasn't trying to uh, flex. You know what I mean? I wasn't trying to flex down the field as I hit the showboat. I was trying to precision or uh, precision modify as I just throw a pick. I, I just do that. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I tried to precision modify the uh, stiff arm, but they don't have that anymore. So it is what it is. But stiff arm works out for me sometimes. You got to understand. You can, if you time it right and do it right, stiff arm can be your best friend. If not, it's just going to be a useless stat. Like spin move is a great stat. Uh, spin is uh, spin is great. As I go ahead and snag that bitches, you crazy. Um, as I uh, snag that interception, but uh, like spin move and juke move are like the two best. Because there's really, to be honest with you, I'm about to bust this wide open. Bust it. As a, uh, I told you, Mark Ingram's a monster. Like I don't know why. It's like the blocking is better for him. I think that's uh, ball carrier vision because. Uh, ball carrier vision affects the way your offensive line blocks. Like, it does. It, it allows you to slide through holes better. That's what she said. Uh, it allows you to slide through the hole easier. And, you know, <laughs> as Jeremy Hill gets in there for six, that's he hits that, uh, what's his name? Rashad Jennings touchdown celebration. I don't know why they didn't have that in this matter. Because he always does it. But it's just some things I don't know. Like, uh, LaShawn McCoy, they never really had his touchdown celebration. At least, did they? I don't know. Anyway, that's not what this is about. Sean McCoy is having a very run-of-the-mill season. And uh, this is it. This is the end of the gameplay. My bad if it wasn't that hype or anything. <laughs> I just really disgusted with Kaepernick's play. I am.